Hello, this is Viquinox, and welcome to officially part 40. I know last episode I said at the start it was part 40. I just had all of the, the numberings messed up. It was actually 39 last episode, turns out. So this is 40. We're going to be going through the 40s now. Just remember that from here on out. Me, talking to myself. Yeah, you. Don't mess it up anymore. You got that? So anyways, I was looking, um, I want to still continue to raise my marksman. I was researching how XP works, and it turns out XP takes longer to achieve. Don't ask me why, but this is just what the wiki said. From level 41 to 46, it's harder to level up. And then once you get to 46, then levels 46 to 51 is easier. Don't know why, it's just what they said. It had to do with the XP numbers or something. So I'm still going to train up my marksman, and I did some research. It turns out Question. there is a archery trainer here in Bruma. So why don't we go talk to her? I know where she lives. There's no hiding from me. Uh, I think she lives up this street here. Uh, is it this one? No. Not that one either. I think it's this one right here. Regner's house. Alright, we're gonna break into this place. Is there a back door? Of course, there's never a back door. Okay, we're gonna break in, nonetheless. Just a quick invisibility potion, so this guy doesn't see me. Okay, don't give me a security level up, you bastard. Okay, let's check this out. How's my security looking? I know you're on the cusp. So apparently this place also has a book in it. Yeah, in this locked chest, I believe there is a skill book. And there's also this rare Nern root. Don't find those every day. What else do we have? Yeah, in one of these chests, there is a uh, marksman book. Actually, is it this one? A dance in fire? Yeah, this is the skill book here. I could come back and read it for in the future when we don't want to level marksman has hard. I'm not going to get it for these earlier levels, but just remember that. There's a skill book. Okay, she's not here. So we're looking for a woman called Edla Darkheart. She could be inside of the chapel right now. It's worth a look. Edla, show yourself to me. I know you're here. Sirac. Logvar? No. This person is definitely an enigma to me. I've never seen them once in my life. Have mercy. Just one coin. I was expecting them to be in the crib. I'm only asking for a seat. That is the most well dressed homeless man I've seen yet. Hammer and axe? Let's check in here. Okay. I've never been up here. Not once. Maybe she works in the store. This is worth a look. Yeah, she could be in this northern winds. Are you Darkheart? Your hair is black. What's your story? Oh uh, no, you are. Yes. All right, this is the one. Edla, Edla Darkheart. If you want to be a marksman, I can train you. If you can breathe, I can teach you. Awesome. Let's get it done. Good that you want to get better. Are you kidding? You bitch! Damn it! Take care. When do they stop being what? able to train you? I can show you some new things. Apprentice level? Okay, so once you hit like 25, Hi. I don't understand. Damn, dude, that's really unfortunate. Okay, whatever. Let's go do a quest. We need to get a rumor. I have an idea. Ah, cool. Over encumbered. And looking at it, we're almost out of feather potions. This is no good. Do we have any more? Okay, we have one sweet cake. Mix that with a flax seed, and we're good. What else is there? Okay. Only the flax seed. Are you kidding? This, actually, we have a few of these. Okay. We'll make all those. One more coin. 
Any rumors? Alga sure can tell a good story. I'm not normally a big fan of Bard's tales, but she's got some good ones. Wow, I'm so happy for her. Blessings of our I need some real information here. And let's look at this real quick. Do I have a bounty? Alright, I do not. We can talk to the guards, then. I wasn't sure. You. Yes? Oh, wow, you got a massive chin. Look at you. My goodness. Thinking freaking cut stone. Hey, you're the one they call the hero of Kavach, aren't you? <laughs> the one that closed the Oblivion Gate and saved the city. Okay. That's enough from you, dude. I'm looking for a tidbit of information. Protect and serve. You too. Is that Talos? He looks just like Martin. What do you need? Goodbye. I could have sworn that there was a quest here that I hadn't done <coughs> before. There's usually like a few quests. Go ahead. I overheard a guard mention the Countess is looking for a piece to add to her collection of Akaviri artifacts. Our taxpayers Drake's at work. Huh. <laughs> Good one. Goodbye. I don't want to do that quest. Go ahead. You hear about Jorunder? He was caught stealing gold, and now he's in jail. Oh, I bet Arnora's beside herself with grief. Now this is the quest I wanted. Jorunder? What do you mean? Arnora and Jorunder were once a happy couple, but that's over now. I hear that he took all their money and stashed it after he committed a robbery. He was going to skip town on Arnora, but got arrested before making good on his escape. Now she has no money left at all. Poor thing. Ah, oh, how sad. Goodbye. Okay, let's go. This is the quest we're after, for sure. This quest is fun. Two sides of the coin. Oh man, that was a jump Ow! and a half. Holy shit. Is this her crib? Or Nora's house. Alright, I need what to remember want? to walk more. Can't you see that I'm upset? Look at that amulet. That's so amazing. Um, let's make friends with Go her. Go ahead. Don't talk such I won't fight you. Not I can't uh, Where did you get that? That not I, I can't that works for me. Okay, cool. Uh well, can you tell me about Jorunder? You guys seem to have a uh, bit of a thing going on. Everyone in town knows about it. I suppose I can trust you with this information. After all, if you can help me recover my stolen gold, you may find yourself earning some of it. The stolen gold? Where is it? Do you have any clue? I know what you've heard, all about Jorunda and his run-in with the town guard. Well, let's just say it isn't exactly all true. I may have let a detail or two leak out to entice someone such as you to assist me. Until you agree to my scheme, I don't want to say more. I want all that I amulet. promise is that you'll be making a lot of money. Are you in or are you out? Sounds shady, I'm out. Okay, keep talking. I'm in. Smart answer. Here's the deal. Jorunda and I have had a rocky relationship at best. Against my will, I've been dragged all over Cyrodiil helping him commit petty crimes. I wouldn't say we're thieves. I mean, we've stolen things, sure. But we've never stolen that much at one time. Just enough to keep us going. That is until last year. Jorunda started to take risks and began robbing more dangerous targets. Not just lone merchants, mind you. I'm talking about the bigger scores, like estates and tax shipments. I begged him to stop, as I knew that his capers would one day lead to violence. He just threatened to hurt me if I got in his way. I think the goal changed him, I really do. He wasn't the man I met seven years ago. The few times I tried to say something, it'd strike me or push me away. I began to become frightened of him. What did this have to do with me? Our last score was a tax shipment being delivered to the Imperial City. We robbed it, and in the midst of the chaos, Jorunda killed a guard. I was mortified. We snatched up the gold and holed up in the mountains. He said if I breathed a word of the murder to anyone, it'd kill me. 
I was terrified of him at this point. Two days later, the Bruma City Guard traced us to our makeshift campsite. I was off gathering food, but Jorunda was captured. Served him right. When I went back to the site later, the gold was gone. He'd moved it! What I need you to do is go to the Bruma Castle dungeons and speak to him for me. Convince him to tell you where the gold is and then we split it. Flawless strategy. I'm totally in on this scheme. He's not likely Look at that amulet. You, so get creative. That is such an awesome looking amulet. She's got mad stuff in here. Okay, let's go start. Norris. So we go to the castle for now. Tidings, citizen. Yes, tidings, tidings. Well met, Middle. Step aside. I know what you want. He's gonna ask me to go hunting for Akaviri stuff. Always I'm not into pleasure. the idea. The Great Hall. Oh, we have to go down the floor. Am I lost? Maybe back here. Yeah, down this way. You're a sneaky looking sort. What do you need? I'm here to visit a prisoner. What a bother. Don't be too long about it. I got to stay with you, so there isn't any funny business. Okay, cool. Man, I walk so fast, man. It's awesome. Okay, good moves. No touching the locks. No promises. I don't know who you are, nor do I care. All I know is that I want you to leave. All right, let's make friends well, with this we'll guy. See. Don't. Don't, please. Well, is it uh, for me? See, I see. I'm not talking to you about anything. You're an outsider. I bet you're trying to trick me into telling something and the guards put you up to it. That fetcher of a guard, Terelius, is always trying to be sneaky. Well, you can forget it. Tell him it isn't going to work. Really? Is that right? Drunder refused to speak to me. He said that he doesn't talk to outsiders. I think he's referring to the fact that I'm not a prisoner. Sounds like the only way to get him to talk is by getting arrested. Is that right? Got all day. Hey, Stop! You violated the law. Pay the court a fine or... Okay, go to jail. Hope you rot, criminal scum. I've committed a crime and have been sent to jail. Perhaps now I can convince Drunder to tell me about the stolen gold. All of your possessions have been confiscated by the guards. You will get them back when you have served your sentence. Activate the bed to begin serving your sentence. Yeah, it looks like we're a prisoner for sure. Damn, how unfortunate. By the way, the guards tossed you in here. I can see you're no friend of theirs. Damn, did I mess up a dialogue thing? I hope not. What can you tell me about the stolen gold? I suppose I can trust you. In fact, maybe you can help me with a bit of a problem and make some money for yourself in the process. I'm in here for the long haul. They got me for murder, even though I didn't do it. Once the Count makes a ruling, there's no way it's changing. I owe all of this to that heartless, treacherous witch, Arnora. What did Arnora do to you? You want to know what happened? I'll tell you. I was betrayed. Stabbed in the back. I'm in here and Arnora's out there, living in my house. Ah, we were doing petty crimes all over Cyrodiil. Small scores. Ten gold here, twenty-five there. Nothing big enough to have them investigate you. Then along comes Arnora with a plan to waylay a tax shipment headed for the Imperial City. We're talking serious gold, complete with armed escorts. I told her she was crazy, but she insisted. 
Women have a way of getting men to do what they want. So we did it. We ambushed the shipment. In the process, Arnora killed a guard. I told her to be careful and just knocked them out, but she didn't listen. We then buried the gold in the woods. Then she disappears to get supplies. Suddenly, the campsite gets raided by the Bruma City Guard. There's no way they could have found us. Oh, well, there's no doubt she tipped them off. But I was one step ahead. I had moved the loot while she was away. <laughs> My final revenge. Or was it? <laughs> Good moves, man. What are you getting at? I'll tell you. I want Arnora dead. That's right, I said dead. She took my life away, and now I want hers taken as well. You do this for me, and you get the gold. All of it. All I need is proof is that damn amulet she always wears. Show that to me, and the money is yours. Okay, cool. Finally, a chance for revenge. So this is the guard he was talking about. I interrupted their dialogue. I don't talk to inmates. Now shut up and don't bother me. Okay. Is there an escape route up in here? Do I have to sleep? Okay. Your block skill decreased by one. That's no problem, to be honest. I know that guy. He's from the chapel. And, um... What's it called? Is it Stendars? Go ahead, please. Rumor. Hey! Maybe not. He looks very familiar. Take care. Looks awesome. Okay, drop the pants. Okay, we're gonna go kill our Nora. I think that's the right call. I usually help our Nora get the treasure back, but this time I feel like the right call is to kill her. Let's do it. Bloody murder. Okay, what we're gonna do is get the Blade of Woe. Wait, what the heck? Somebody's breaking shit down here. Oh, she's doing magic. Okay, do we have a Paralyze? Yeah, we do. Okay. Good. Waster, waster, quick. Okay. I have slain our Nora. We should take the amulet off her body and bring it to Jurunder. Let's check real quick. So I still have a bounty of 40 for an assault. Our Nora's thing, our Nora's key. Cure poison. So there is another amulet, if I remember correctly. Yeah, her true amulet. Let's check this out. Have to take that off real quick. Okay, we got this blue one. Really cool looking. Then we got practically the Amulet of Kings. That is straight up pimp, dude. These look very cool to me. And they weigh nothing. Okay, let's re-equip our stuff. Easy enough kill. Her body's kinda tucked. Oh my goodness. E excuse me. Uh, Are you yeah, right? excuse me, dude. I... Fuck, fuck. I wonder if he knew. <laughs> oh shit! Hey, I'm told Dude, you scared me. Requests your company at your earliest convenience. Holy shit! <laughs> oh well, what's this regarding, dude? Countess Carvane would prefer if you speak to her in person. She also said to present you with this stipend as a taste of things to come. My lady holds court from 8 in the morning until 6 in the evening each day. Okay, dude. That would be the best time to see her. 
Shit, man, there's no reason to pounce on me like that, especially when the guard's freaking chasing me. He totally knows I killed that woman. Holy shit. Are we safe? I think we're safe now. To a point. Um, okay. We may have to... Okay, we're gonna drop this amulet here. This one is... Is this one considered stolen? If I drop this... Okay, they're both quest items, so they can't be taken from me. Never mind. Holy crap. That scared me, man. He just freaking jumped down the stairwell and was just like, You! The Countess seeks you! Ah, oh, dude, why? Oh, shit! I haven't got all day. Oh, okay. We can go back in here then. Stop! Fuck, dude. That's too bad. Okay. Shit, it was just an assault. Well met, my lord. Okay, now let's try to get back in there. <coughs> How much money do I have? Okay, we have so much money. State your business. Visit the prisoner, what man. What a bother. Don't be too long about it. I got to stay with you, so there isn't any funny business. Okay, cool. It's got everything under lock and key. Don't get too close to the prisoners. Mission accomplished. Show me the proof. Two amulets? One of them must be a fake. Clever girl. Taught her everything I know. Good thing you saw through her ruse. Yeah, I think she did set him up. To be honest. So she's dead, eh? Ha ha! Finally! Finally someone has wiped that stupid smug grin off her face. <laughs> good, good. Oh yeah? Well, you did your part of the bargain, now I'll do mine. The gold is buried outside the walls of Bruma, near the north gate. Goodbye. I don't expect to be seeing you anytime soon. If I were you, I'd get out of Bruma fast before the guards catch on that she's dead. Prisoners may not accept gifts. They won't figure out that I killed her. I mean, they know I assaulted her, but that's about it. Okay, let's go get this reward. And how about these necklaces? Alright, I can still wear them. Good. We'll stash those. Those are all unique. All right then. I'm listening. That guy's going back to frickin' Leowin or something. Wherever the hell he goes. Where's the items? Is this it? In this chest. I found the treasure that Drunder concealed outside the walls of Bruma. This is trash. Yeah, that was really just it. Am I missing something? Alright, I guess mission accomplished. Yeah, that was easy. I was expecting a bit more. I guess I was wrong. Right? Wasn't there supposed to be another thing that happens? Okay, I guess that's it. Usually what happens is the guard who talks to him about the treasure, he's like, I know you're hiding it somewhere. Just tell me where it is. You're never leaving anyways. You have a life sentence. He's like, I'll never tell you. Well, he's supposed to come out here and attack you. Some odd reason he's not here. So it's whatever, I suppose. Wait a second. Something's trying to kill me now. Right? Am I hallucinating? Kind of weird, to say the least. Okay. Well, now that that's done, we can focus on leveling up some skills, I guess. We could also go explore some more. I think that may be a good idea. Try to get some Oblivion Gates. Let's do that. And also, let's look at our skills for a second. Our destruction is 73. So why don't we try to get our destruction up to 75, and then we'll start leveling up Restoration think that's a good idea. So for now, let's start marking some places on the map. So like, for instance, this place 
should have an oblivion gate. And let's resume our spell stuff. Okay, good. That was a super easy quest. Didn't really get much. Let's drop a quick save and check out these books real fast. See what they do. So, Biography of Wolf, Speechcraft, Mace Etiquette, Blunt Skill, Surfite of Thief, Security Skill. Okay. All skill books. Not bad. Apparently there's like 200 types of skill books. Like a ton of them actually. So we'd have to read a lot, to be honest. But they're also like random loot spawns in dungeons and chests and things of that nature. I could read them now, but I don't really feel like it. Can I get up this hill? Yes. No. Okay, there we go. So yeah, we'll try to just grind out the next level this episode. We probably don't have enough time, Ow! knowing how the leveling works. But we can still Ow! explore a bit and grind. A zombie. This must be like a hideout for necromancers or something. Come on, let me up the mountain. Try my best to jump. Okay, almost. I know you'll let me up. I know it. Yes. Nice moves. Keep it up, keep it up. Okay, almost. Yes, we did it. Cheeky eagle. Okay, I already know I hate the western side, the northwestern side of this map. Um, what the hell is this place? I think we made it to where this oblivion gate is supposed to be. Unfortunately, seems like it's not here. So let's move our marker, drop a quick save just in case we die. At least now we're on like a real road, instead of having to frickin' hop and skip everywhere. There's not much room to do battle. Oh cool. This Daedric Shine, Hermaeus Mora, I've never done this one, not once. You have not yet followed the path required to speak with the Lord Hermaeus Mora. Go then. Yeah, he wants you to complete every single other Daedric Prince's mission before you can actually talk to him. Which is whatever, if you ask me. I just never actually did that mission before. I think I've gotten to the dialogue, but I've never actually done the mission. This is the reasoning behind why I want to actually save the arena, because I feel like if you do the arena and you do that quest in tandem, it's pretty easy to um, complete his request. Okay, it seems like there isn't one here either. So let's run down this mountain. How about this side? We'll run down here. Ow. Okay, let's be careful. Let's heal. Store HPs. And there's also this here. Let's get up here. Stupid bear, get out of my way. Man, that's a grand entry to get to this place. Lip Sand Tarn. Ow! Quite the walkway. Can't wait until we get our restoration up. My goodness, I'm going to be casting so many healing spells. Okay. <coughs> Is there one here? No, does not seem like it. Whoops. 
Okay, and the other possible spawns are here. This is good to do. I'm going to have to do this a couple of times through this playthrough. Oh! But discovering new places, and my goodness, wow, this is quite the view. And ah! closing oblivion gates, ah! super important to me, at least. And it's just good opportunity to skill up while I'm running, discovering. Oof! Again with the pain, can we not? <laughs> Okay, acrobatics though. Every fall damage you take, it's like doing the equivalent of 10 jumps in this game. Let's heal again. Restore the bit of health. And run this direction. How close are we to the marker? We're practically there. We'd be able to see it if it was in-game. Oh, cool. There's some nerd root. Okay. Apparently there's one here. I'm sure we would have seen it. There's definitely one here at Battlehorn. So let's go do that quest. We just have to help some knights kill some shit. At least I think that's how it goes. So let's do it. Close down the other gate. Okay, there is no gate here. Um, Alright, let's do this mission. Here it is. Do I have enough potion made? Let's investigate. I don't really have too much in the way of damaging poisons anymore. Okay, good. Let's make some of those. Um, damage health. Actually, let's remove this. Let's do this. And get that. Unfortunate. Restore Magicka. We don't have any more fire damage, unfortunately. Okay, we'll save onto the spittle sticks for now. Okay, 11 of those. This has Paralyze. Not many other things have Paralyze, though. Um, we'll use this. And then... Fortify, Fortify, okay. Where is the... Am I looking at the wrong thing? Wasn't there just St. John's Nectar here? The health? Could have sworn I had that. Did I accidentally make the wrong potion? Okay, whatever. 20 things. That should be good. I want to keep the knights alive. Unless they're protected, then I can just run away. Okay. Where is this place? Here we go. What do you want? A marauder warlord. Goodbye. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on here? Are they trying to kill me right now? Actually, I've never done this quest. I thought this quest had to do with the oblivion gate. How wrong am I? Alright, you want some, bro? Let's get homeboy out. Yeah, mess him up. Okay, one down. Demolish their faces. You ain't shit to us. Okay, she's wasted. Wow, they got some really good items that we could sell back in Coral. We should totally do that. Okay. Waste them, waste them, quick. Okay, good. He's got some healing on him as well. Alright, these archers tend to be the weakest. Not bad, not bad at all. We win. 
Why don't we collect some of this enchanted gear that they have? Uh, do we lose a man? Lord Kelvin. Shield of Truehorn. This is some unique stuff here, isn't it? Okay, cool. Can we carry all this? Nice. How about this guy down here? He has some standard issue stuff. Marauder, and then this one was a Marauder Warlord. Okay, let's snag this Shield of Truehorn. I don't think he has any other unique items here. Okay, let's go in. Wow, look at this place. This place is freaking impressive. Okay, it's kind of like a uh, Duke's place, or Count. Looks freaking great. And it's all seamless, too. I like it a lot. Private quarters. It's a lot of items you can stash here. I should probably make this my main base. Let's talk to this guy. This is indeed a dark day for all of us left. But I thank you for risking your own life to help us. Here, take this. It'll tell you all you need to know. As the newest master of the castle, I bid you welcome. Is that right? I'm the newest master. Alright, let's check out this thing. Um, where is it? Count something, right? How about Andre's letter? Is it this one? No. That was the guy who jumped off the cliff. Lord Kelvin's will. Last will and testament. Lord Kelvin, son of Terran, and a sworn knight of the True Horn, upon my death, do hereby bequeath Battlehorn Castle and all her lands, dependents, and chattels to the bearer of this document. Such an unusual document requires some explanation. I resort to such measures out of desperation. I pen this while Battlehorn Castle lies besieged by a band of ruthless marauders, with little hope that any of us will survive. Besieged, I say, although this petty battle would not have even rated a footnote in the great days of the Knights of the True Horn, we have fallen on hard times indeed. I will entrust this document to my last faithful retainers with instructions to destroy it in the last extremity. Although I accept that I may have provided the means for my murderers to legally take the lordship of Battlehorn Castle, so be it. To the new lord of Battlehorn Castle, whoever you are, know that you inherit a stronghold with a proud tradition. Battlehorn Castle was built by a remnant of the Knights of the True Horn who were exiled from our homeland of Lanelin and Hammerfell after a failed battle to dethrone Baron Shrike of Lanelin. Our leader, Lord Kane, ordered us to split up into as many small groups as possible until the time should come that he would recall us. My father was part of a group that settled here in Cyrodiil and built Battlehorn Castle as a refuge while they waited for Lord Kane's message, a message that never arrived. Over the years, all the knights of our little band either gave up or passed on all but one, my father, Terran. Since his untimely death, I have continued to hold Battlehorn Castle in the hope that someday we will hear from Lord Kane and our great exile will be at an end. I am afraid that the fortunes of Battlehorn Castle have fallen on hard times. What resources I had available, I devoted to maintaining the castle itself. Its walls still stand strong, and its hearths still provide warmth. Sadly, this came at a great cost, and many of the items within its walls had to be sold in order to meet the enormous payments such as maintenance begets. If you find yourself with the means to restore Battlehorn Castle to its former glory, a friend of my father's name, Nilfus Amelian, still holds many of the castle's accoutrements in storage and on account. All that is required is to repay the castle's debts to Nilfus, and I'm certain he'll happily return the items. My final request for the new lord of Battlehorn Castle is to continue to uphold the proud traditions of the Knights of the True Horn, and to honor the memory of our brave service. Okay, cool. Yes, sir. Uh, return to your duty. All right. He could follow me, which is cool. Uh, we have to find this person. Here's another knight. Well met. Is this a quest we can do right now? It is. Okay, let's do this. Yes. Am I in the wrong place? Let's look at the map. It doesn't really specify, does it? 
map. Okay. Imperial Market District. I'll keep that in mind. Let's go to, uh, was it Coral real fast? Make some sales before it turns nighttime. We only have a couple of minutes to get there. How close are we? Okay, we're practically there. Yeah, I want to sell this stuff off to the blacksmith. I will hold on to the shield. Ah! Then we can switch back into our travel gear right after. Man, that travel gear really makes life that much easier. Okay, keep on going, rub. And re-equip our spell. Bam. That was a fun little quest, a little detour. Quickly make some bucks. Get my map back up, too. Uh, where should we go next on this map? Let's go here. I don't think I actually cleared that gate, so let's make sure we do that. Fire and steel. Yes? We're gonna make our way down to Anvil. Only quality goods for sale. Haggle a bit. You're an expert. I guess 48 will do. You have the most money here, so... Might as well sell to you. What if we push it a bit more? 50. That's a good deal. You're telling me. Boots of plain striding. Make me a better off. Okay. Undefeated. Fortify health. Death march grieves. Fortify fatigue. Anything else? How about a flawed pearl? We'll keep the standard pearls. We're up to 100k now. Look at us go. Let's see what we've got here. Take care. See ya, dude. Okay, re-equip travel gear. Um, don't need that. Okay, looking much better. Speed racer, send it! Super speed, we're so fast. It's not for our own good, keep in mind. Often breaking our ankles, just trying to get places. Soon enough, we'll have master acrobatics. Uh, I'm planning on resuming the Thieves Guild in a couple episodes. I think that is the right call. Okay, let me look at the world map real quick. Okay, this one is number 26. This one we have yet to do also. Um, apparently there was supposed to be one here. Battlehorn Castle. It wasn't there, of course. So instead we're going to still explore these highlands. So we can always come back to this one later. Ah! This is a quick clear, for sure. Ah! Oh, dude, are you serious? What the fuck? You cornered me, that son of a bitch. That was sketchy. Can I still make it through? I think so. Whoa, whoa! Near miss. Flash fire. Uh, yeah, that's the way up. Um, take your time, take your time. There we go. Is there any more healing up in here? 
Okay, we may have to pop a potion. Store HP. Good thing we did that. That was a bit sketchy. Okay. Let's go close this gate. Oh, cool. There's items here. Let's actually snag these. The Ring of Thieves. It's pretty good price on there. Okay, we'll snag just about everything. How about you? What do you have? A lot of money. That was 600. Okay, good. Get the frickin' sigil stone and peace out. Ah! What do you think we got this time? Um, we had that one. This one is new, I think. Yeah, that one is new. So, silence, resist magic. Okay. Let's go through the unexplored areas. I do know that we haven't done this one. And I know we haven't done this one. And I don't think we've done this one either. I think we've done this one. I don't know. There's a lot of them that we have to go check on again. But at least they're already marked on the map, so it will make our life just that much easier. Once the pop-up appears for the um, expert level of destruction, I'm totally switching to restoration. Alright, there it goes. I had a feeling it was soon. And it appears that we don't have the Oblivion Gate here. So this one was 26. This one was supposed to be 35. So we'll do this one, just down the ways a bit, right here. There's apparently one that's possibly here? I don't think it is there. We would have spotted it. And there's supposed to be one that's here, too. And I don't think it's there, either. So we're going to continue down this way. We can go check on this one. And there's also one that's supposedly over there. I don't think it's there, but we'll check on it nonetheless. Let's equip a new spell. Let's use... Where is it? So we can now use Drain Skill, which is awesome. Is there a Restoration Training? Where are you? Resto T. We'll equip this one to 4 instead. Okay, so we got two levels. Let's check out what our current Restoration is. It's 18. So at 26, Restoration should be good. We'll get the Apprentice pop-up, and then one ha! more. Level up. Did we discover that location? Okay, we did. Can never be too sure. Can see skin grad from here. Quick and easy level ups. Oof! Then we just have to get to a really spongy enemy. Okay, it seems like the one that we're after isn't here. Okay, that's fine. Let's go ever so slightly down a bit. Actually, wait. That was the one we were trying to get to. Okay. So instead, we will go here. Yeah, 34, and then... Hold on. I'm trying to, like, keep tabs on what what is what. Okay, this one is technically 27, and then this one down here is 31. So let's go check this one first. Okay. It's a little bit confusing to keep tabs on what's what. Looking at this map. Oof. Uh. Ah. Did I get a infamy, by the way? I have to look at this. Okay, good, I didn't. Yes, thank you, game.
You never know. Just never know. So I can still use the way shrines if I run into them. I haven't been running into any of them, to be honest. Okay, there is definitely no Oblivion Gate here. So instead, we will go to this one, number uh, 27. We already found it on the map. I just don't know if we've actually gone through it or not. It's totally worth a look, in my opinion. Okay, let's make sure we save. <coughs> Shit's gonna get intense here. Should also heal. Actually, wait, hold on a minute. There may just be a way shrine down here. I don't have to use a healing item. Oh, cool. Ha! New Nightstone. Let's get this one. Ha! Sure. Scythian Web. Scythian Web. This sounds like a really cool power. Four or five marksmen. Speechcraft, illusion, security, mercantile by 20 points for 120 seconds. That's really useful. I'll try to remember that if I ever have a lot of stuff to sell. Okay, seems like there's no way shrine. We'll pop a potion. Yep, there is this oblivion gate. We gotta shut. Alright, this one's easy to maneuver around, and also we'll snag these. Okay, super useful. Make the jump. Ah! There we go, now we're talking. Saves us so much more time, to say the least. Alright, let's look around here. There may be a healing well somewhere. No, it doesn't seem like it. Maybe up here. Yes. <laughs> oh, dude, really? Damn, lucky shot. I haven't died in a while to anything. Okay, let's get through here again. Quick, 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 dodge. And we got the free heal, too. Much appreciated game. I needed that. Whoa! Whoa! Too close for comfort. My goodness. Nearly got the kill shot. Okay, here's the room. Is there any healing up here? There is. Nice. Free heal. <clears throat> Things are looking sketchy. I'm panicking. Okay, items. Two gold. Ow! What? He mid-air killed me. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. They're super accurate with those shock spells, it would seem. Okay, free heal. Money. Quickly, get down there. Yes, okay, much better. That was quick. That's how it should have been. Let's see what we got. We got a duplicate. Resist disease. Okay, that's good. Let's check out our map again. Okay, so this one was... 27. So there should be a nice clusterfuck here of portals. There should be like three next to each other. We could probably see all of them at once. So let's go get those ones. 29, 28, and 30. All in the same vicinity. There's got to at least be one within that spawn range. By the way, running around like this, it has a purpose, I swear. We're going to Anvil so that we can actually get some marksman training. Because it seems like that's the only place where there is a freaking marksman.
Okay, so we're here. And I don't see any within the spawn radius. There should be one here. There should be one here. And then there should be one about here. Which is crazy. None of those have spawned in. So instead, now we're going to go all the way to the west here. There should be a couple of them here. Should is the key word, right? I'm having a good time running around, though. I love getting map markers I didn't have, and discovering every location is part of someone's 100% uh, run. As for me, I don't know if I'm going to do that. It'd take a lot of time. I'd need to like have a map of every single marked location to actually stand a chance. Right now, I only have a map with the Oblivion Gate locations on it. Wow, what a bitch. Throwing shade in my direction. I only just met you. Okay, let's look at our skill up, by the way. It's been a while since I looked. Okay. So this one went up by two. This one went up by four thus far. So we need four more levels. We're actually gonna get what we want. This is the most in contact uh, fort I've seen. We also have another Daedric Shrine. Let's talk to the leader of this cult so that we can actually get the quest marker, come back later. You. You dare come here to the shrine of our lord? You are not one of us. Who cares? Shrine of Malakath. I want to speak to the Daedric Lord. I guess you haven't heard. We don't like the beautiful people. But maybe you can persuade me you're ugly inside. What do you mean by that? I guess you have- Okay, so I'm gonna have to buy some more cheap wine. Do not Is that what you mean? Patience. Okay, we'll buy more cheap wine. He didn't give us a quest either, which is unfortunate. Okay, so is there an actual Oblivion Gate up in here? I don't think so. Yeah. There was supposed to be like one right here. In this direction a bit more. Nice, another restoration. It's not there. There was one here, number three. And then at this point, at the, there should be one. But I didn't see it when we were at the shrine. But we'll go back, nonetheless. Ow! Any second now. What do we have here? Yeah, this one doesn't seem like it's here either. Ha! <gasps> On the brink of death. Let's drop a quick save just in case I kill myself. <clears throat> okay, yeah. Where could the other ones be? Apparently there is one here. I probably would have seen it when we we're training up our marksmen, but I'll go to it anyway. We gotta go to Anvil, anyhow. Okay, Crowhaven. It doesn't seem like it's here. We have explored a lot of the map, to say the least. We are doing great. I feel happy with our progress on this character. Okay, good. It's been a while since we've been to a way shrine. Nice. Okay, let's make sure we purchase some wine. I feel like next episode we should try and do Malakath's Daedric Quest. So I'm going to actually post up a map marker here. Just a reminder. There's Maik again. He already did his trek from Lewin back here. Maik, no. Did you? Yeah, you got a new rumor. Maik longs for a Kolovian fur helm. Practical, yet stylish. Maik is very sad he does not have one. Yeah, they were everywhere in Morrowind, and we're in Kolovia. There's not a single one. How weird is that? 
Where is it? This area is considered Colovia, right? The Colovian Highlands. Yeah. There isn't a single Colovian hat for you. How strange is that? Alright, what time is it? It's currently 12. Let's go to the house. Um. Okay. Aventus. He was supposed to train. Unfortunately, that's not the case. We do have this archer woman inside the cave here. Let's go check in with her. Continue to get better. She is the advanced trainer, after all. Restoration goes up. I wish there was a way that you could control the map markers so that you can have some on the map and then have some not on the map. Like, just specific types that make life much easier. Okay, is she asleep? She's gotta be asleep. Yeah, she's asleep. Okay, she won't offer training at this time, will she? It's my pleasure. She does There's train. Much I can show you. Let's yes, get please. To... Let's see if pay attention. Let's get to. Tra There's much I can. Sh awesome. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, dude. You're a sneaky looking. Should I send these Maybe. pirates out? I want you to head out and plunder. Of course. The crew will return in one week. The trainers still stick around though, right? Yeah, it looks like the archery trainer still is here. I'm okay with that. So I think I cleared out these two gates already, and I know I cleared this one out. This is the Kavach one. We'll go back and clear out some of these. Meridia, I think we did Meridia. We haven't done Sanguine, I know that. There's a lot we have to catch up on. But we're practically covering the entire map. We discovered a lot of Oblivion Gates, and we are going to close most of them for sure. I want to resume the main quest, and I also now want to resume the Thieves Guild stuff, which I think would be good. We're going to do Malakath's quest next episode, and then I think I will get back to um, doing the Thieves Guild stuff. Tears of the Savior? No. Arrows of Extrication. We'll do this one. Yeah, let's make sure we mark that, just to make sure. And, uh, yeah. In the next episode, we will resume our level grind. Let's check. We have, I think, two more levels of this to get. And then we're good. And then we can stab things as often as we want, and then hit the next level which should be awesome. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. This was episode 40. I'll see you in the next one.